everybody, welcome back to the channel once again. We got some early reactions for Shazam. Apparently, DC and Warner Brothers are so happy with the reaction that they lifted the social embargo a month early. Uh, you know, some people can actually look at this like trying to trying to compete with uh, Captain Marvel. I think it's funny, like Captain Marvel is getting ready to be released this weekend. My review's up, you guys can go check it out. So, Warner Brothers DC is like, you know what? Let them talk about Shazam too. Let, let's re like, let's remove the social embargo and have people start talking about that. And I knew if I didn't talk about it, I would get called out on it. I was gonna wait till Sunday to talk about it, but I was like, no, I, I can't. It's, it's too long. I have to talk about it now. So anyway, I'm here at CinemaBlend.com, and I'm gonna read just a couple tweets, maybe three tweets, of what people think for uh, Shazam. I am highly looking forward to it. It is one of my most anticipated superhero films. Like, for me personally, I, it kind of goes Endgame and then Shazam for me. Those, those are the two that I am just excited to go see this year. So, Eric Eisenberg writes, DC is finally building a solid run, which is awesome because Aquaman had a lot of positivity. A lot of people didn't like it, but the majority of people loved Aquaman. And now, it looks like they're putting together a nice solid run. Shazam is a delight. Its familiar origin structure is forgivable because of all the new it brings to the table. Then we go to Sean O'Connell here, who writes, Really likes Shazam uh, at Zachary Levi, is perfectly cast as a teenager in a hero's body. Then we have Jermaine that writes, Shazam is another win for DC. Sure, the humor and action you would expect from a superhero film are there, but Shazam stands out because of the emotional family story at its center. So... That is three that we've seen, three tweets about the family stuff. So that that actually that kind of has me excited. I think they're really gonna play into the whole the whole adoptive family and then him kind of accepting the family. And I, I I really think um, they're really gonna go with that angle. And it looks like people are really enjoying that. And then we'll read one more. And it comes from Ash Crossman who writes, Shazam was damn near perfect in my book. My favorite DC movie, DC EU question mark. Where what are we saying now? Um, by far, pure of heart, incredibly funny, full of in-jokes and references, brought me a childlike joy to watch. The role was made for Zachary Levi. Just a whole thing of positivity, which I expected. I expected, you know, because the trailers looked fantastic. I went to go see Captain Marvel opening night, and sure enough, they didn't play an Endgame trailer, they didn't play a Spider-Man trailer, but they played a Shazam trailer, and the theater was just laughing and having such a great time watching that Shazam trailer. And it, like I said, it's one of my most anticipated films. I can't wait for it. But does these tweets have you got even more excited? Are you excited? Be sure to leave your comments in the comment box below. Until next time, as always, I'm Robert Storms, and that's my opinion.